Good morning. It's Monday. The Monday after Super Bowl. After the Eagles. <laughs> Blew it. Oh, waking up a little sad. I am thankful though we're on the West Coast. So all of you guys that are on the East Coast, I say this every year after the Super Bowl, like um, you have to be tired because I'm tired and we went to bed pretty much at the normal time last night. Yeah, so I think I heard on the news or on one of the sports stations yesterday while we're watching Super Bowl coverage, I'm pretty sure Philly and I, I'm pretty sure Jack had said her, um, his sister either has the day off today or they all have delayed starts, that kind of thing. I understand, <laughs> especially after a tough loss. It's probably hard to wake up. I don't know, Philly, are you okay? You had the, the Phillies first for baseball. We lost the World Series and now the Eagles blew it last night. So there's that, but it's Monday. It's a new week. Tomorrow is I Love You Day. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Strange, our news is so boring. So with the Super Bowl being here last yesterday and then the golf tournament last weekend like our news has been crazy like we've had so many guests in town it's back to normal now just like that super bowl's done golf tournament's done our good weather is done it's supposed to rain today rain tomorrow which is perfect because the weather held up for all of our festivities and it's supposed to rain and be like i think she said it's 22 degrees different from yesterday to today like it's only supposed to be 58 for the high today but that's okay everybody's going home getting on their private jets going home and we got to go on with our lives <sighs> got to go back to school and work today it is what it is um trying to drink my coffee i gotta go make sure mason's up because he was um a little uh, drowsy this morning i went in there and said hey it's monday we gotta go get up get up and he's like okay okay um, so yeah, happy Monday. We're gonna have a good week. Yes, we're gonna have a good week. Let's have a good week. Good morning. That's how I'm starting off my Valentine's Day. It's Valentine's Day. I'm trying to wake up my forever Valentine. One of them anyways, Mason upstairs. <laughs> um, it's supposed to be rainy. I don't know, is it raining? We might have a rainy Valentine's, which is fine. We don't ever do anything. I stay home, cook for my boys, so. Um, Mason is supposed to have baseball practice though. But if it's raining, he might get to stay home and not have to go to baseball practice. So stay tuned for all that. But yeah, it's Tuesday, February 14th, Valentine's Day. I'm ready. I'm ready for my boys, my Valentines, my forever Valentines to come home. Um, I just laid out all their gifts. I'm about ready to head out because I am making pasta for dinner and I have a jar of Alfredo sauce, but it's so much better to make your Alfredo sauce from scratch. So I'm missing a few ingredients. I'm gonna head to the store and then hopefully also try to find a fun dessert because I don't have a fun Valentine's Day dessert. So I wonder if the store is gonna be crazy. It's always fun watching everybody go and buying all their Valentine's like flowers and all the chocolates and stuff. So I'm ready to head out to do that. Ace, you checking out your gift? Where'd he go? Oh, he ha he's ready for Valentine's. Look, show them. He's got his pink little scarf on. You ready? It says hug me. It was crazy, at least by like the flowers and like all that stuff that you get for Valentine's. All the stuff that I tell Jack, do not buy me because it's marked up like crazy. I would rather him buy me flowers on a random Wednesday than Valentine's Day. Does anybody agree with me? Like, I should have looked at the prices, but like the way that they mark up roses, it's, it's crazy. I went with like an ice cream cake for our fun dessert because we just had cupcakes um, on Super Bowl Sunday, so I wasn't feeling like cake. So this is ice cream, so that'll be good. Um, I'm about ready to make the best, it better be the best Alfredo sauce tonight for dinner because Dan Zeisen to make my um, Alfredo sauce with. So that's gonna be yum, can't wait. It's waiting for my boys and you guys, it is sprinkling. It's been off and on all day, nothing really heavy, like it's not flooded or anything. I kind of hope that baseball practice is canceled. I know that sounds terrible. Um, just so that we don't have to wait till super late to eat dinner tonight, because we will wait for Mason to get home from practice if practice does happen. So 
kind of waiting to hear on that. Um, maybe Mason will have an update when he comes home from school. Are you gonna have practice? Oh, wow. You guys, it's coming down again. I see nothing. It looks sunny to me. <laughs> oh, it smells good. We got the dog will want to go out. So. Oh, Ace, can't yeah. go outside. We got the official word from Coach. Practice is canceled because it's still drizzling out, which I knew. I'm like, yeah, that's not going to happen. Practice is definitely not going to happen today. And I'm okay with it because now Mason gets to hang out with me. <laughs> and Ace. And Jack. <laughs> He's going crazy though. Um, but Mason's like, can we open our Valentine's? I'm like, sure, I don't we're no no time frame. Like I was gonna do it after practice, but like let's do it now. Sure. Can we appreciate my Valentine? <laughs> you guys I love it. It's a red bag, what do we mean? Fa la 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 la. Happy Valentine. <laughs> Even Ace is like judging you. <laughs> No, apparently there's not a big enough bag for my present. I don't know what's in there, you guys, but he had to use a Christmas bag because he was not going to go out to the stores right now to get a bag for yeah. my Valentine. But thank you. I love my follow la la la. No all right, Ace. You've been patient all day. Is that Ace's? Oh, you got a toy, dude. Ready? Is it a pink piggy? Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> you got more! Ace, Ace. You got, there's more! Ace, look! Look, dude. He doesn't care. Ace! I think he likes it. Mason had to steal the toy back to bring him back in here. Ooh, Forever. is that gonna be your dessert tonight? Ooh, cookies. Ace has a, a dessert for tonight. Nice. Moochie pooch. Ooh, <laughs> he likes to use smooches. Look, Ooh. he's like, that's mine, that's mine. I'll cut it for you, bud. <laughs> There's more. What? Treat. Choose me. Ooh, that's for your breath, your teeth. Ooh, yeah. Thank you. Gotta have good breath, right? Ace, look. And it's some heart treats. Yeah, that's yours. Yeah. Wanna try one? Okay. Tell brother, open that bag, yeah. Kessa. <laughs> oh, oh good yeah. boy. Kessa has a fun <laughs> squeaker's weird. Alright. Which one's yours, Mace? I don't know. Which one do you think it is? I don't know. That's yours. Oh. He loves his Mike, Mike and I? Ike's. I don't know why I took that off. Yeah, in the box. Bang. If these aren't the right color, you exchange them. It was hard shopping online. Is that them? Oh, okay. I think so, yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yeah? I don't know. Okay. We'll I don't see. know. I thought maybe they were a little bit more gray when they got delivered here. I'm like, well, those kind of look gray. Well, I want like the blue. Yeah. But yeah. Um, he wanted like the blue gray one, so I think that's them. And then, Dad, this is you. This is me? Yep. Okay. Is it flowers? Did yes. Ooh. Nice. I'm telling you guys, we do practical gifts for Valentine's around. Getting around you here. ready for the summer. Getting you ready for the summer. Like we were just it. talking about that. This might be our last snow or last winter storm that yeah. we're having. Summer is on its way. I like those. These are very nice. And then this one you guys can share. Yes. Yes. We will share, yes. <laughs> we will continue okay. to share. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Surprise. Nice. <laughs> Happy Valentine's, boys. Thank you. Thank you. So your Christmas gift? Yes, okay. okay. Is it my turn? Sure. Get my Christmas Where's gift. Oh, it's kind of sharp. You are jawsome. <laughs> it's so cute. Ace, you might get another toy. He steals all my little plushes. Candy. I feel like I just did this. Ooh, I'll share. Okay. I'll share with you guys. Okay. This was Ace's idea. This? Yeah. Did we seriously all buy yes. each other's shoes? <laughs> no. Yes. My goodness. Well, thank you. They said you needed new shoes to walk them in. I do. Because <laughs> I just showed Jack, like, it's literally about ready to go through the sole. It's really bad. These will work perfect. Thank you. 
Thank you, thank you. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy, Happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day. Everybody. You too, sir. Everybody's hungry, of course, including this one. He just ate. <laughs> um, dinner tonight, if you guys remember, when I was shopping at Aldi, I picked these up a while ago before they sold out, but look how cute. I love it. So we're gonna do that with my homemade Alfredo sauce, and then I have some sweet Italian sausage. I also have garlic cheese bread and Caesar salad. So that's gonna be our Valentine's dinner. Excited? Oh yeah. Oop. So we decided not to mix. We did it on the side, and so it doesn't look very good, but I'm sure it's gonna taste good. I know it's gonna taste good. Garlic bread. Dig in. Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. Happy Wednesday, everyone. I am bundled up because the dog cannot wait any longer, even though I would like to wait longer, but he is ready and needing a, a walk, like really bad. <laughs> um, so I'm bundled up, you guys. We had the most crazy storm last night, like the amount of hail and thunder, lightning. It was insane. They're talking about it on the news all morning. Um, so much snow, like, up north like it just was one of those crazy storms probably should have logged it but it was dark out and the camera doesn't do it justice but it was insane so anyways i'm bundled up i do get to use my new shoes that jack got me so about ready to put those on it looks like mason he wore his new shoes but jack got the flip-flops i do not think that he's going to be wearing flip-flops today because it's only supposed to be let's see it is currently it oh well it went up one degree it was 41 it is now 42 degrees but it's only supposed to be a high of 55 today so all of you guys are gonna be like oh okay whatever that's not that that cold but the fact that we were practically 80 degrees on super bowl sunday to 55 today <laughs> that's crazy gotta love living in the desert it happens so but like I said yesterday, it's probably going to be our last storm, so we're enjoying it. So, all right, you 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 being patient enough? You ready? You would go for a walk? All right, let's head out. <laughs> I I'm going to be a popsicle, but that's okay. He's worth it. It is still freezing, you guys. I just got back from the grocery store once again. I know I was just there yesterday, um, and it is still cold out. But Ace and I had the most eventful W A L K. I can't see it because he's right there. <laughs> this morning first of all it was cold second of all um he found a little bit of snow patch that's what i was calling it even though it didn't snow but we got so much hail last night and like slush that when we went for a walk this morning it was still at one of our parks like it was on the um like a slide and it must have just kind of slid down so it was just piles of little like slush everywhere so ace had fun with that and then anywhere that there was like standing water it was kind of like icy so crazy and then when we were almost home we ran into a coyote so it's cold out and we ran into a coyote gotta love the desert i'm telling you arizona you kill me sometimes but we're safe we we ran a little bit it's not the first time we ran into coyotes on our walks but uh this little coyote's been hanging out lately. I saw him a couple weeks ago, hadn't seen him, and then I saw him again this morning. So he needs to get out of here. But I think what's happening is we have a lot of kitty cats in our neighborhood right now. And unfortunately, I'm wondering if he's like feeding off of them because where he's hanging out is where the kit cats used to hang out. So I don't know. So that kind of makes my heart sad. It was poor kitty cats. Valentine's is over, you guys. They're already, they had hardly anything left for Valentine's. It's time for Easter. <laughs> I picked these up for the boys. You guys, if you've been following us, they know them. The sweet little lady that was ringing me up, there was no price on them. I had no idea, but I was like, I'll just get three because normally they're buy two, get one free. No, there was no sale. In fact, they were like a dollar, what'd she say? A dollar 35 a piece or something? She's like, these little suckers are expensive. Are you sure you still want them? I'm like, yes, I, I still want them. Um, but yeah, just a little... It's funny to see, you know, Easter stuff just like that. Like all the Easter baskets are already out and stuff. So one of the reasons why I went, ribs are on sale. I picked up some ribs. They're like on super, super sale this week. My sister-in-law, Joy, has a really good um, Instant Pot recipe for ribs that she had making. So I'm going to text her and say, send me that recipe because I'm going to do ribs in the Instant Pot. Have you guys ever done that? Hopefully they turn out... Joy said they were amazing, so. All right, let me put the few groceries that I got away, and I think Mason should be home 
any moment now. He should have practice. Um, the field should be okay to have practice, but we'll see about that. Um, it's just gonna be really, really cold for him, unfortunately. Last night I was an Italian cook. Tonight I'm a Mexican chef. <laughs> We're doing fajitas. We got some beans. I just grated some uh, fresh cheese. You guys, this thing is the best. Um, I have an avocado left over from Super Bowl Sunday. We got our tortillas, salsa, that's for dinner tonight. Good morning, happy Thursday. It's another cold, cold morning. Um, 31 degrees is what it was when Mason left for school this morning. So pretty miserable. But this guy, he doesn't care, you guys. He doesn't care that it's 30 degrees out. He said, let's go for a walk. It has warmed up. It is now 41 degrees, so it's better than 31. Um, but out with the old, in with the new. This is why he's going crazy because he I pulled this out and he knows. He knows that means we're going for a walk, but this is what he's been rocking all month for Valentine's. Now we get to celebrate St. Patrick's Day. Yes, do you want a new collar? He's, he's like, I don't care mom, let's just go. I'm gonna switch out his, uh, the, his collar and then head out for a little walkity walk and hopefully not freeze again today. All right, you be a good boy. <laughs> All right, let's head out. So like they can't Get rid of it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, we had a little bit of a baseball game tonight. Um, just a last minute scrimmage. So Mason got to pitch an inning. So we just got home from that. Thankfully, the field doesn't have lights because it was starting to get really cold, but we had to end before the sun came down. So that worked out. Jack and I, he had to ride the bus. Mason had to ride the bus. We're back to riding the school bus. Um, Jack and I stopped and got canes for dinner on the way home. I was going to pull out frozen meat out of the freezer. Thankfully, for some reason I didn't because I didn't feel like cooking dinner after baseball. So got Mason a little bit of cane. So as soon as he gets home from the bus, he has dinner as well. Happy Friday, everyone. We made it to the weekend and it's a three day weekend. I'm excited about that. I've been hard at work since it is a three day weekend. I always do a lot of my chores on Friday. That way I can just enjoy myself on the weekend. Um, the kitchen's completely cleaned. I mopped, cleaned up, pulled everything out, you know, the air fryer, pulled it all off, cleaned underneath everything, my usual stuff I do on Friday. But I'm looking around, you guys, I still have my Valentine stuff, but not for long. It is time. It is February 17th today. Can you believe we're halfway through February? Like, where did February go? Um, but I am ready. I am ready for March. I am ready for baseball season. I'm ready for spring training. I think maybe the little last minute scrimmage game last night got me a little excited. Like, baseball, all the, the catchers and pitchers are reporting their, their spring training spots right now like either in arizona or florida like it i see it all over social media and i'm excited i'm so excited take everything down you guys know how i do this if you've been following me um, pile it up i dust i'm gonna vacuum got that out already and then put out the few things that i have that screen for saint patrick's day that that's the plan and then i think i'll be done i can sit down relax and enjoy my weekend you guys this is kind of sad i've got to put away swoop picking up all the valentines and i saw him till next season dude it was a it was a good season thanks for all the memories <laughs> a lot of sitting on the couch watching the eagles with my family always a good time so yeah he'll he'll get retired until next football season <laughs> but don't worry you guys because we do have a phillies one that i'll put out so out with the pink and red got my saint patrick's day stuff up ready <laughs> house is clean just waiting for Jack to get home. He should be home from work anytime now. Um, Mason has a, a long day ahead of him. He had school all day, and then after school, he had to go to a meeting. I believe it's like a concussion meeting for baseball. 
which is good that they talk about that because concussions are very scary. So he's got that. And then right after that, he has a baseball practice. Um, so I won't see him till late tonight. So on that note, you guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog because as soon as Jack gets home, he'll want to edit. So we just plan on hanging out here tonight, making dinner, nothing exciting. So don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.